Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I'm going to talk about 5 essential extension for PS4. The first extension I'm going to talk about is called Jellyfish. So here you can see extension option, just click on it and here we are going to search for Jellyfish theme. And there you go, here you can see Jellyfish theme, just click on it and here we need to click on install. Once you click on install, there you can see the color change and here it will show us the theme for us. We are going to choose jellyfish here and if i now close it there you can see our code become more colorful so this way we can easily indicate our css and our normal coding and after jellyfish i want to talk about another extension called code snap so using this extension you can take a snap of your code and it looks really good so again let's go to our extension and here we are going to search for code snap and there you can see we have code snap and it has 2.9 million download so here we are going to click on install and there you can see it is installed so we can just close this so let's say we just want to take a snap of this code so we just need to select it then right click and here at the bottom you can see code snap if you now click on it and there you can see it look a snap and it looks really good there you can see so you can share this code with your friend so after course map i want to talk about cssp so let me just click on this extension again and i am going to search over here cssp and there you go this one the first one so it has around uh, 6 million download and i already installed this extension so what does it do it actually uh, let us easily find any CSS class. For example, uh, here you can see we have a href. Inside href, we have style.css. If we now just hover on it and click on control and click on it, it will take us to style.css. And uh, let me just show it for another class. Let's say for this one. For it, we just need to click on control. And then if we just click on it, it will take us to that certain css and if you want we can change the color as well so this is really useful tool so after css speak i want to talk about auto rename so let's go to our extension again we are going to search over here auto rename and there you can see auto rename tag select on it and we need to click on install trust publisher and install and there you can see it is install so what does it do uh, let's say uh, we have a div here and instead of div we want to rename this div so for that case uh, we need to make changes here and then here right but since we installed auto rename if we just say here span then you can see it automatically rename robot here so it make our orb a lot easier so after auto rename i want to talk about live server so let's just click on extension and here we are going to search over here live server press enter and there you can see live server click on it and i already have live server installed so if you install live server what will happen uh let's say you have live server installed it means if you just right click on your code and you will see an option over here open with live server you can now click on it it will open in the browser and there you can see there is a ip address over here so the benefit of using live server is that if you just make any changes and save it over here it will be automatically applied over here so here you can see we have the website and our code let's say we make some changes over here instead of cleaning let's say here paste and the moment we save it here it will be automatically implemented over here so this is really useful tool for vs code so those are the most five useful extension for vs code i hope you like this tutorial Make sure to give a like and subscribe this channel and I hope to see you in the future tutorials.